Welcome, ladies and Jew boys, too. I'm Aravero here as always. And here is Brand New World in what is a relatively new mod pack, which has been created by uh, Wells Knight, who you might know from Hermit Craft, one of our the um, big boys in the YouTube world. And if you've noticed, quite a few of those big boys in the new YouTube world are making their own mod packs lately. And Wells Knight has been working on this one for about a year, which is to say that he made a teaser video saying he was going to make a 1.10.2 mod pack about a year ago that took after um, a few of the a few of the other uh, mods uh, took after some mods that he preferred, like uh, Life in the Woods. Um, and such things like that, and then, and it wanted ha he wanted a builder's pack, basically. We have, so we have lightly modded vanilla here. Let me actually do stuff with this wood instead of carrying it around looking meaningful. Um, so, anyway, we have, uh, it's lightly modded vanilla, so basically we have all of the goodies for, um, building. Uh, let's, let's have, well, I would have a look at the mod pack. What the heck is that? Olives. I got olives from the olive wood tree. Shocking. Truly shocking. Guess I should have been paying a little bit more attention to what I was actually doing, maybe? Okay, we're gonna need some wood. We're gonna want to pick. So let's get rid of this. This thingamabobber here is the one probe read me, which is only, okay, let's, let's just show you. See, there's this one probe read me thing. Okay, if you... Click it like that, it'll give you this, which gives you the option of turning the thing on, off, or something else. Or, if you shift right click it, it opens this, which lets me grab a hold of, uh, yeah, yeah, somewhere, okay, put it Wayla style. Okay, this is a selection for what you want it to look like, and if you put, a, if you click in the picture, you can put it wherever you want. And this is what is called a heads up display, which will tell you, like, for example, what block I'm looking at. So right now I'm looking at my crafting table up there at the top of the screen. It tells me I'm looking at my crafting table. It tells me my crafting table is from Minecraft, the actual game, and it has a check mark indicating that the axe that I have in my possession will break that table. Okay, so that's your basic heads up um, display. And of course, uh, there's that you can have. This is the one probe, which is one of many heads up displays that are available in modded, in case you don't know anything about modded, and um, you can do quite a lot with it. I need to get some food. Food, food, food. Die, die. Thank you. I don't think I'm going to eat you, baby. What's this? What's this? Hydrangea. All right. I need some food. And I need some, probably I need some more wood, so it's not a good idea. I wonder if I can eat these olives. I can't eat olives. What can I use olives for? I can make cooking oil or pemmican, which is a something like beef jerky. Um, mince pie, okay. I can make fruit punch out of olives. That's interesting. Um, I can make a fruit crumble out of olives. Does that sound tasty to you? It does not sound tasty to me. And I can make oiled olives. How strange is that? Okay, let me get another. This is iron wood. Let's, let's actually use the axe instead of the um, olives for cutting wood. I think it probably will work better. And let me get some wood down here because I'm going to want to stand on this. It looks like this is a little bit taller tree. Okay, so basic Minecraft stuff. Even in modded, you always open up with basic Minecraft stuff. Okay, so anyway, welcome to my brand new world in Mil Wells Knight's brand new mod pack, which I just wanted to try out because lately I've been itching to do a lightly modded world. I stream modded and I record, I, I have my vanilla world, uh, with the vanilla server that I play on, that I'm also making videos on. And so basically I thought I would, since I stream vanilla and I stream, play, record vanilla, and I also stream some more heavily modded, I've also been wanting to just do lightly modded. In other words, something that's just the same as vanilla without all those confusing tech mods, but also... Oh, excuse me. Uh, I've got just a touch of a cold. Um, 
Good grief. I've had the itch for lightly modded is what I was saying. And boom, Wells Knight made a pack. And it is, um, you know, it looks like the mod list is fairly nice. Okay, so I'm starting. What I just did, um, for those of you who don't know modded, is I punched that um, garden. And, of course, there's not going to be one here to see now that I, I anyway, the, I, that this plant that I punched, it produces little food crappy things like that. And some of the, like this is peanuts right here, so I could possibly make peanut butter out of peanuts, or I can use those things for seeds to plant gardens to grow peanuts to eat later. And this is a plantain. Now some of these, not all of these, like for example, that plant is from a mod called Plants. Not all of those plants produce flowers, or excuse me, food, but some of them do. So it's kind of a crap, oh, doll's eyes? Bane berries. Okay, so anyway, some of these produce things that are foods, and I guess they might be useful. That one's got uh, pokeweed. Now, it, pokeweed, <laughs> I used to live in a country house, you know, with a little pasture, and, the, oh, what was that? Galapagos leaf, you can eat that. So there's things that you can eat all over this pack, even if you don't see these from Pam's Harvest Craft, which are actually intended to be food. Like, there was a carrot in that one, so I can plant a carrot crop now, right? Okay, so there's lots of things that you could eat. You just have to walk up to them and give them a try. Now, what I'm doing is I'm right-clicking. Yes, right-clicking. I had to stop a minute and double-check my left and my right. But yes, right-clicking on these plants just to see if they will give me something. Some of them do, some of them don't. And what I also want to do, and here, look, here there's another one of these Pam's Cross. I also want to go, so yeah, collecting food is easy-peasy in this pack. Um, it won't be very good quality food though. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to go toward, um, I want to go toward zero, zero, because I have this thing where I just like to have my life a little bit organized, so I want to go toward zero, zero, so that I can, um, okay, that jumping just seems to be a little out of whack. Butterflies, I don't remember seeing butterflies. Oh, house, there's a house, that could be a good thing. I mean, who, who doesn't want a house, right? I mean, it's not where I want it, but um, didn't I make some tools? I did make some tools. I just didn't make, a, ooh, there's stuff in it. Uh, this is probably from Recurrent Complex or maybe even from Roguelike Dungeons, which uh, both mods, uh, both of those mods add, there's a door on the other side, I add in these types of structures that you can find in the world. This one I think is a Recurrent Complex one. And it has these cobwebs, which you think are not really that great, but they are because, and um, I'm going to take this oven too so I don't have to worry about making one later. Um, and actually, I'll take that chest as well. I don't need a crafting table, so you can keep that. But um, anyway, this berry, this bush here will probably produce berries. Oh, deciduous leaves. No berries. Well, there's bushes in the area that are shaped like that that do produce berries. So um, anyway, so I want to go this way. Uh, my goal is to get to zero, zero, hopefully before the sun goes down. Uh-oh, it looks like it's going to have, oh no. I don't want to be in a cold biome. <sighs> okay. So anyway, wait, I need a button. I need a button. Give me the button. Okay, there's the button. I just needed that button. I'm following my quartz. Okay, here's a bush that I can grow berries off of, but it'll also give me berries now. So I don't know if it'll work very nicely for like a topiary or um, um, whatever, but I want to just, I'm aiming for zero, zero is what I'm doing right now. I've got about 600 blocks to cover. Hopefully I can do that fairly quickly and get it done before the sun sets. It kind of looks like it's going to be a bit rough terrain. I'm going to go to zero, zero and at zero, zero I'm going to set up a mine. And then my life will be all nice and organized, uh, hopefully, assuming there's actually land there because we walked across the ocean, I mean ice. So that might mean that if we walk across, that might mean, there's these particles, I do not know what's making these particles. They are kind of weird. I, my best hunch is that they are um, like cold, related to a cold biome. Uh oh, I got in a spider web. How'd I get in a spider web? Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Gosh darn it, oh gosh, oh Grady. Okay, I got ground to cover. I ain't got time for spider webs. Okay, that is a recurrent complex building that has a dungeon in it. 
uh, or you know probably has spider spawners just from the look of the spiders I'm trying to cover ground I'm about to run out of my ability to uh oh something's not right okay I've apparently been going the wrong direction I've been going the wrong direction this is going to be a bit of a problem and I haven't seen any sheep either which would have been really nice okay um all right I, I think I was going the wrong direction I was thinking I had to go 600 blocks this direction that direction but instead it looks like I have to go 600 blocks this direction crash okay let me get a thing down a thing like this and get into a boat because a boat's going to be safer at night <laughs> it's a fairly safe that it that's how you make a boat that that's how you make a boat okay I'm gonna try it up here just because it might have a different recipe <laughs> how do you make a boat oh gosh okay um I don't want to be standing around I want to continue to move I don't want to be out at night because I'm chicken <laughs> if, okay so um, I have to go this is not good this is not good this is not good I don't want to be out at night and now there's a mountain in the way okay I'm gonna go that way I can go no I'm still going the wrong way oh here's a here's something there's a cave over there that has a mushroom in it that gives off light I mean yeah, it's not wonderful, but it might be just enough to be protective for one night. I don't want to dig a hole in a weird place. I don't want to be out at night. Okay. There's a bird. So one of the things that this pack has is all of these different bits of wildlife. So let me get in here somewhere where I can be a little bit sheltered and protected. <laughs> I'm scared. Where's my stuff? Give me my clobble. Give me my cobble. Okay. So there's, um, yeah, is it dark? It is dark. Okay, it's really, really dark on my um, display right now. I'm so sorry. Um, it's really dark. Let me see if I can fix that. Thankfully, I don't have to dig very deep to get an oven going. So um, let's just make a little bit of charcoal. And so then I'll be able to make. Whew, I will be able then to make, I'm going to turn off this, um, let's get out of there, I'm going to turn, oops, wrong button, this one, I'm going to turn off the, um, what's that called, the F3 screen, because it's just too much all over the screen, oh, excuse me, I have these intestinal troubles from time to time, okay, and while I'm at it, I need to go ahead and try to eat some of this food, it would be nice to be able to hold it, um, hold on to it for later but um, it's also going to be important to be fed so let's see oh gosh I'm getting a little bit more coal from that than I meant to um, let's see I need to cook these two pieces look at this I've got three whole pieces of meat that's hilarious what's that a bubble bugle lily okay so I apparently picked up an ironwood sapling but I didn't pick up an olive sapling. That's interesting. Iron berries are just a food. So anyway, um, let's. That's also a food apparently. I wonder if there you can cook it. Nope. Okay. So let's look up the boat because I want to see why I can't make a boat. <sighs> All right. I did it right. Why are you being stubborn? Hmm. Why is it being stubborn if I used the right? That was not the right block. Ah. Give me that. Okay, I made a boat. That's a boat. Maybe, oh, no, 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 no. See, vanilla woods. This is one of the things you have to watch for in modded because sometimes it can be sneaky like that. Some mod packs will have a boat recipe for every kind of wood, and some of them won't. So because I didn't have, have vanilla wood where, that I saw, immediately first thing when I started I now cannot make a boat which is what I wanted to get but it's okay because I was going the wrong way anyway so now this three cotton we can turn into string if I go ahead and make a sword I can turn these cobwebs into um, oh it's dark again let's do this this the coal, coal this stuff there we go 
torches there we go if I do torches then you'll be able to see for one thing all right torch I'm gonna put a torch put a torch right there and then and then and then and then I was gonna put these cobwebs here if I break these cobwebs with a sword I can get string from them if you break them another way you don't get string okay nope that's not what I wanted okay so that means that I can make a bow I have enough wood to make sticks to make a bow with um, let's see I always forget this it's the sticks in the arc and the strings there we go as far as that goes I could go ahead and make a fishing pole just because I have which is probably also oh, I guess I, I did that wrong too there we go um, we can save that for later and a little bit of corn leather's a very good thing um let's see i need a little bit to eat let's eat um what else can i cook have carrots that's a good thing let's see we can use those okay i'm thinking what do i know what i can use these for most of these it looks like they're just going to be oiled foods so that's not wonderful but let's look at this peanut okay so the peanut can, we can get trail mix with peanuts raisins and chocolate well we probably have to do something with grapes to get raisins let's see these all look like a more there's pemmican again this is raw tofenison okay we can get a peanut seed which I mentioned before we can get oiled peanuts we can use it to make a type of bread we can sell it to get hmm I'm not sure if this is by it. I think this is by uh, peanuts with an emerald, but I'm not sure where the ship shipping bin would come from. Let's see if we can craft the shipping bin. Okay, shipping bin. Yeah. Oh, you put an emerald. Okay. I'm not sure how that works, but that's okay. That's the thing about modded is you kind of have to muddle around and figure these things out as you go. Okay, I'm gonna eat this steak. Hopefully that'll give me some regen. I now have a bow and, um, 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 wait. Oh, I don't have a mini map. I'm used to having a mini map, but sometimes the mini map will tell you what time it is. <sighs> oh, that reminds me. Okay. Um, um, which direction is out? Is it this way? I don't want to lose track. Of well, that'll work. Now we can see what time of day it is. And it looks like it's almost night. I mean, almost day. How strange that there's cobble here. No, I guess I put cobble in as I was coming in. Oh my gosh. This episode is looking really, really organized and wonderful, isn't it? Okay, let me go ahead and pick these things up. Ah, the, the, uh, what happened? Oh, the torch melted the water. So now you're in the dark again. You can't see that it's dark because the, to the water is like, I have ice in here now. Um, so yeah, all right. Now let's, I mean, not ice, water. There's water that came into my cave because I had a torch that was in contact with ice. Okay, so here comes the F3 screen again. It's probably also gonna mean I can't see the stupid mobs coming, but let's see. I wanna go towards positive Z, that's this direction. I also wanna go toward, good gravy, look at that cave. Why does it look like that? Okay. It's almost day. I can go up the mountain, maybe somehow. Hey, that was like really good parkour for me. Okay. Ooh, whoa. Uh, for a minute there, I thought that that bird was like a mob, like a hostile mob. I mean, Ooh, I feel like there's a little bit of lag here. That's not wonderful. Let me up, please. Uh, that F3 screen is making me feel like everything is in my way. Okay. I want to get to zero zero. Hi, big cow. That's a Hereford cow. It, for the, the little particle just then, it kind of made it look like that that particular cow was... Okay, so I want to go to zero zero because this is me being fussy. Positive X, positive Z, because I want to be in control of my... Well, hello. Is... is Why does it look like this? This is like some kind of fog effect, I think. Um, Actually, it might be... Let me check options um, 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 video settings my my render distance must be down a little bit maybe that's what it is done done um, that doesn't seem to have helped 
Um, and that makes me a little bit nervous because I remember one time of Once Upon a Wind, not necessarily in this mod pack, I had this kind of a visual effect and then... Must be biome related. Okay, um... I had this kind of visual effect one time in a mod pack and it was... And then my and then my world crashed in a really hard way, uh, and I couldn't get it back. Okay, that that's a lot of lag. All right. Uh, okay, what do we see? Um, all right, all right. What do we see? What what is that? Rocket Cress. Okay. I don't know. I'm just trying to get to zero zero, and I think I'm still going the wrong way. Nope, I'm not going the wrong way. Um. The question is, I think I'm going to be in the water is what it looks like, which will be something we'll have to negotiate around, but I have a plan for that too. Maybe not so much of a plan for the, there being ice. Actually, ice would make it easier because, you know, we could just build with what we have on top of the ice. What's, what's that? It looks like ice under the ice. Okay. I don't know what it is. All right, go back this way, go this way, this way. There's more. It's going to be in the water. It's going to be in the water, and I can't build a boat because I don't have vanilla wood. Did anybody see any vanilla wood? Did I go past vanilla wood? Look, there's vanilla wood. It's going to be in a boat. But if it's going to, if it's going to be, Oy. okay. Let's let's confirm. We might. Ju there just might be water over there. I mean, a land over there that I can't see yet. I I, I should be able to see the land by now. Okay. I should be able to see land by now. Huh? Oh, there's water lined up land right there. Um, there's land close, but it doesn't look like there's land there. Ooh, come on. Yep, it's over here somewhere in the water. In the water. What is that? Is that land? That's land. That's too far over there. Okay, so anyway, what's going to happen in between episodes is I'm going to establish a mine shaft at zero zero which it looks like is gonna be a bit of a trick well not that much of a trick this is 1.12.2 after all so therefore we have concrete so I will be going over there and collecting some sand and going wherever else I have to go to get gravel to make concrete to put down in zero zero and I will probably have to build out a um, dirt structure <laughs> so that I can drop the first few blocks because yes I'm well I'm not sure that I, let's let's not do that let's not do that let's go over here this will be close enough we can build a house over here hey there's something over there there's a stone structure over there that's probably a recurrent complex structure or else oh no that's a recurrent complex one I can see the top of it at the top of the hill that's a dungeon that's okay I say, I say that, but we haven't spent a night here. Maybe it's not like that. Maybe it's not nice. But anyway, there's a dungeon that we can conquer after we get ourselves just a little bit established. We can establish ourselves right here. This will be close enough to zero, zero. I can get over myself. Or I can find a place over here, like 100 and zero or something. That'll make me happy. Like 100. So if I go 100 and then to zero and then I can just oops stop drop myself a mine shaft here oh that's just the exact same kind of dungeon that we already passed but look at the world generation so the bottom of it is exposed so that's cool um, it has potential it has potential but I'm out of time for this episode so as I said, I will drop myself a mine shaft um, hereabouts, and um, we will start doing stuff in the next episode. So yeah, air doodle doo, toodle doo.